Hello, YouTube! This is the MFNSR Avis Cup Series Season 5, Race 9 of 15, the Cobalt Tools 400, live from the Las Vegas Motor Speedway in Las Vegas, Nevada. On the pole today, we have Kurt Gibson in the 10 car, followed by Connor Kellis. Third place is last week's winner, Tommy Hrynek. Fourth is Jake Williams. And fifth place is Greg Brown. And sixth place is last season's winner here at Las Vegas, Frankie DeSarlo. So let's get the cars rolling off here. Oh. Levi Schoen's your points leader starts about midfield. Here we go. Last season was a bit of a crash fest, or wreck fest, or however you want to phrase it. Hopefully we've toned that down a little bit here. I actually want some racing. Only 27 laps here, uh, similar to Homestead. So yeah, pace car dives down for the pit road. Here we go. Kurt Gibson down into the tri-oval, and green flag is out, and we are racing here at the strip. Down into turn one, they're looking okay already. Kurt Gibson with the early lead put Hrynek up to second, Greg Brown to third. This is, this is, so we got some weird camera angles here. Uh, this one's not that bad. Maybe. They're really barreling, barreling it down in there. Oh, we got trouble! Josiah Kopp is into the wall! Caution's out. What a huge wreck. Oh, oh my god, they're they're piling up everywhere. Austin Ogo, Drew Austin, John Dillon, Sean Galligan, Jesse Caperso, Pichu London, Charles Jackson, Luke Martin, Noah Hart. All these drivers involved. Let's see what happened. Alright, Josiah Kopp is going to get squeezed with Frankie DeSarlo and Jake Williams. So you're going to take three good cars out of the race here right from the get-go. You'll see Cop just sandwiches DeSarlo into Jake Williams, and Jake Williams gets some serious air. Chuck Petty? Chuck Edwards? What's his name? I don't know. Chuck. Chuck gets involved. Jeremy Tacos is there. Luke Martin, the 97, as Sean Galligan will win at Las Vegas, is what I would say, but he's actually right there. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, you can see who's involved here. There's Levi Schoen's your points leader. He uh, he might actually escape here. Who else? We got Eddie Jones, Carpenter, Buchanan, the 78, Jeffrey Howe, Matt Edwards, Pichu London, Noah Hart, Charles Jackson, Robert Piet, Drew Austin, Paul Stella, John Dillon, Mark Matthews, Jamie Smith, Christian Gearhead, Elijah Koufax. So pretty much a butt ton of cars. But I think some of them will be able to continue because this was kind of a fender bender. There were, the only major hits were to Jake Williams, I think. So anyway, let's get back to the restart. All right, we are back here after that huge wreck. We have Kurt Gibson, Tommy Hrynek, Greg Brown, Connor Kellis, Jeffrey Buckeye actually having a good run and not crashing. Carter Keselowski sixth, Brooklyn Nordeen seventh after watching her teammate explode. Natalie Haydens is eighth. Ooh. Uh, Eric Burton, 9th, and Chuck Petty, with some back-end damage, runs 10th. So pretty much there's only 9 cars that don't have damage, so that's interesting. Anyway, pace car dives down for pit road. We'll be on lap 6 of, or, yeah, we'll get, go green on lap 6 of 27. And green flag is out, and we are racing once again. Tommy Hrynek keeping up with the 10 of Kurt Gibson this time around. Here comes Connor Kellis for third. Oh, this is a pretty crappy angle. Interesting. Krynik and Gibson are side by side. Into three. Looks like Krynik's going to stick his nose in there. Oh, it gets a little loose. Gibson will lead another. We stay green. Here comes Connor Kellis, three wide for the lead. Man, this, this camera angle really smells. Oh, 
Here comes Kellis with help from Carter Keselowski. Whoa, Carter, look out. Oh, man, they're, they're making some contact here. There is some contact. Tommy Freinick wins it to the line, and the caution's out, it looks like. It is Jesse Caperso and Noah Hart and Robert Piet. And oh my god, Elijah Koufax just fi finished flipping over. Let's see what happened. Here we are with the 21 of Jesse Caperso. He's running 29th. He has some damage. I don't know what's going on up here, but... Yeah. So, anyway... Uh, Caperso's gonna come back up onto the track here. He's already going pretty slow. Sean Galligan's there. Probably gonna cause the wreck. Uh... So Caperso just comes up in the way of Matt Earnhardt, and Matt Earnhardt is just like, no way, Jose, even though your name's Jesse. Then he spins him out. Oh, yeah, he just spins him right around. Sean Galligan actually misses it. Oh, Robert Piet, not so much. Same with Charles Jackson. Oof. Ooh, Luke Martin gets a little piece. Caperso slides down the track. Acosta and some other Dodge got made it out. Uh, now we need to have a look at our friend whose name is... Who, who else was involved in that wreck? Oh, Elijah Koufax. Good old E. Koufax. So, here we go. He's just got some congestion here. And he's just going to come right up on CJ and spins around. But there's a, there's a twist of lemon in this situation, and its name is Luke Martin. Luke Martin, you suck. And, uh, yeah, so I, th I think that's it. Oh, no, it gets hit by Jake Williams. Awesome job. And Koufax will indeed flip over, so. Yeah, there has been a flip in every race so far, since there was just a flip just now. So, welcome to the Avis Cup Series. I think that's it. Pretty crazy. Let's get back to the restart. Alright, we are back once again. We have Tommy Hrynik, Connor Kellis, Carter Kozlowski, Brooklyn Nordine up to 4th, Jeffrey Buckeye 5th, Kurt Gibson back to 6th, Greg Brown 7th, Eric Burton 8th, Natalie Hayden's 9th, and Jeffrey Howe is 10th. I think the top 9 are the only ones I can keep up here. So if you're in the top 9, you got a great shot to win the race. If you're Jeffrey Howe and back, mm, no. Sorry, but no. So, here we go, coming back for the restart. We'll be on lap 12. Uh, here we go. Green flag is out, and we are racing once again. You got a four-car separation, and never mind. Here comes Carter Kozlowski with help from Brooklyn Nordine. They'll take second. Kozlowski wants the lead, though. Uh, but it looks like Brooklyn Nordine, nope, is going to follow right right behind the 41. Carter Kozlowski all over the back end of that 7 car. We stay green. Oh, never mind. Is there a wreck? Oh, we got a wreck. We got somebody riding the catch fence. Here comes, oh my god, John Dillon upside down. Oh my god, they're wrecking everywhere. Oh my Jesus, I just wanted to get to the lead. Carter Kozlowski in the lead now. Here comes the 34 of Brooklyn Nordine. But don't forget about Tommy Freinick coming to the line. It'll be the 41, I think. Yes. Holy crap, that was quite the wreck. John Dillon had, had a ride. Let's see what happened here. Well, here's a case of the stupid. Christian Gearhead is just going to straight up turn the 98 into the grass. But Paul Stell is going to turn the 97 as well. So they're synchronized spinning. And then the 98 is going to come up and be like, yo, no. And then he's going to slam the wall and ride the catch fence. Getting some pretty, pretty lot of air. That didn't make sense. And then they're just going to pile in. There's Levi Schoen's your points leader involved. He's spinning. The 98, the 33 flips over here. And yeah, just carnage. This is probably the most intense wreck of the day. Uh, Charles Jackson, CJ, Gearhead, the 33, Sean Galligan's there, Caperso, uh, Noah Hart, and Levi Shones. So now let's. I want to get an onboard of the 33 because I think that was actually a pretty, pretty popular flip. 
on board John Dilly. Ooh. Hello. Yeah, damn. Well, that was fun. Let's get back to the restart. All right, we are back. Starting to run out of laps here. We're going to come to the line with 10 to go. We have Carter Kozlowski, Brooklyn Nordine looking to better her career best of second, which she's done twice, I think. Tommy Hrynik slips back to third. Gibson back up to fourth. Jeffrey Buckeyes maintained fifth this entire race, pretty much. Greg Brown is sixth. Connor Kell is seventh. Natalie Hayden's eighth. Eric Burton ninth. And Jeffrey Howe remains in tenth place. So, yeah. Carter Kozlowski hasn't won since season one. He has three wins, though, which is up there amongst the all-time race winners. But he has had a long drought, and he would love to end it here today. Here we go, back to the restart. Green flag is out, and we are racing once again. Carter in the 41 needs to hold off Brooklyn Nordeen, who comes from powerhouse that is cop racing. Although I don't think they've done very well today either. Here comes Nordine on the bottom, Carter Kozlowski on the top. Who's Freinick going to go with? And Kurt Gibson is there as well. They're four, well, they're two by two. Four cars. Two by two. Gibson's all over the back end of the 34. And Greg Brown goes around off the back of the 17. Caution's out. Carter Kozlowski will maintain the lead. And I think Greg Brown might have come up on the track and caused, caused some problems here. Let's see. There's Carpenter. Yeah, Galligan's in trouble. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got big-time problems. Let's see what happened. Well, Craig Browns got straight up turned by the 17. They've been racing around each other all day, and I guess Connor Kellis just couldn't handle it. But that's okay, because neither of them will comment on this race. But, anyway, Greg Brown just spins it through the grass. He's just going to come right back up into Dylan Young and Mark Matthews. Eddie Jones just gets clipped. Matt Edwards makes it through, though. And Jamie Smith gets involved. Drew Austin, Austin Ogo, Chuck Petty, Acosta, Zach Buchanan. Actually, those guys actually made it out. But yeah, these guys' days are done. Lot Jamie Smith, a lot of damage. So, yeah, I don't think anyone else piles in. I, I hope not. We've had too much of that. Anyone else here? Oh. Charles Jackson with a lot of damage. I don't know what happened to him. He's he was racing with Sean Galligan. Oh, we had we had another problem here. Charles Jackson is going to straight up turn the 44. Sean Sean's not going to like that too much. Mm, yeah, just hooks him right into the outside wall. Oof, that's a hard hit. Hard hit by the 44. The 42 is going to keep going though. And in case you just missed the last 30 seconds, Charles Jackson wrecked Sean Galligan into the outside wall very hard. And Oh, but there was more problems, and the 99 of Carpenter just gets clipped by the 42. What happened to the 99? Well, we're going to have to go to TV1. Oh, the 99 gets turned by the 88, just straight up, like, goodbye. Uh, yeah backs it into the wall, and then gets hit by the 42. Yeah. Alright, so I think we got to the bottom of all the wrecks. Let's get back to the green flag. Alright, we are back here. We're going to have five to go when we come back to the uh, green flag. We have Carter Kozlowski, Brooklyn Nordine, Kurt Gibson, Tommy Hrynik, Jeffrey Buckeye, Eric Burton, Natalie Haydens, Connor Kellis, Paul Stella, and Jeffrey Howe. So Greg Brown is eliminated, so now we only have eight decent cars. So, yeah, this is, it's crunch time now. I'm sure Carter's on the edge of his seat. Uh, gotta get it done here. He, he had one slip away from in Hartley Pool last season, and I know he was upset about that, but he's got another opportunity. Green flag is out. We are racing again. Carter either wants, he, Carter's probably praying for a caution, I would assume. And, uh, oh, Kurt Gibson sticks his nose underneath of the 34. Here we go. This is exactly what Carter Kozlowski wants to see. Them battling side by side behind him. This will allow him to get away. Kozlowski dives it into three and four. He'll, he'll pull away just a little bit. 
Jeffrey Buckeye all over the back end of these guys. We stay green. Kozlowski's pulling away. Gibson's clear for second. Let's see what he can do. He started on the pole. He's got one of the fastest cars. Kozlowski's got about a four or five car length lead. Smooth sailing up to this point. Brooklyn Nordine going to lose his spot to Tommy Krynik. Here comes Jeffrey Buckeye. Three to go. Gibson's closing. Gibson's, I think they're about even off too, but I think Gibson's a little bit better in three and four. You can hear Carter really have to breathe the throttle. Yeah, Gibson catches him a little bit. Here we go, two to go. And when the caution's out, that's it. Never mind, Carter Kozlowski will win the race. So much for that, that would've been a great finish. But I'm sure Carter's not complaining. Who we got? Eddie Jones involved, Matt Earnhardt, Paul Stella, Ryan Acosta. Oh, that was gonna be such a good finish. But congrats to the 41, let's see what happened here. All right, Paul Stell is going to turn down on the 17, I think, here. So this actually happened up front. And he's going to slide into Eric Burton. He'll hit the wall hard. And then the 62, oh, nowhere for him to go. And he'll plow right into the 79. Matt Edwards gets involved as well. And then I think these guys will slide down out of the way. So, a right, bummer. Everyone's kind of upset except Carter Kozlowski, I'm sure. But uh, that would have been a great Great finish, because Gibson was closing. All right, let's get uh, Carter Kozlowski crossing the finish line. All righty, here is Carter Kozlowski. For the first time since season one, he'll finally, he'll finally cross the finish line to win a, a, a win an Avis Cup Series race. Out of turn four, he'll not he will not pull into pit road. He's got it. Into the trioval. They're going painfully slow. Painfully slow. But anyway, Carter Kozlowski will win at Las Vegas. Congratulations. Carter's a big fan of the series and he watches all the races week in and week out, so it's nice to see him get rewarded. Kurt Gibson will bring home second. Hrynik will get third. Jeffrey Buckeye fourth. Natalie Haydens will end up with a top five. Booker Nordine slips back to sixth. Jeffrey Howell finished seventh with a pretty beat-up race car, so props to him. That's this is two races in a row that he's had to battle through some adversity. Connor Kellis will take home eighth. Eric Burton ninth, and Austin Ogo will get the top ten. And there's Matt Edwards there in eleventh. Let's get your official results. All right, here are your official results. Hopefully, we don't have any raging this time. Uh, so Kozlowski Kozlowski takes the win. We went over your top 10 pretty much. Matt Edwards 11th, Caperso 12th, Mark, Matthew, Mark Matthews 13th. Zach, Bu Zach Buchanan will be the last car running in 16th. Uh, let's get everyone else. Frankie DeSalle will get last, the Taco 41st, Luke Martin 36th. Where does your points leader finish, if I could find him? Where's... Uh, Oh, 28th for Levi Shones, so his by far his worst, fi worst finish of the season, so maybe some guys will be able to capitalize. So yeah, thanks for watching, comment, rate, and subscribe. We'll get uh, a picture of Carter crossing the finish line and the points and all that good stuff. So thanks for watching, comment, rate, and subscribe. Next week we'll be at Dover, I know that for a fact, and then we will take the All-Star break. So yeah, comment, rate, and subscribe, and peace out, yo.